hi today i'll teach you how to install laravel 8 by composer first we need one directory or a folder like this you can create and you can rename it i am giving laravel you can give any name laravel 8 and in this directory we will install our laravel so just simply type it cmd command prompt and here we will write our commands to install laravel but first we need composer so just type it composer and check composer or install or not so this command this composer command will check your system your pc your window have composer install or not so my pc have a composer installed if you don't know how to install composer you can check out my previous videos there i have taught you how to install composer then we will install a laravel installer so simply we have a command composer command to install laravel installer so just type it composer and then then we want to install globally so just type it composer and global glo global so this will this global command will install our composer or globally so let's type it a require and then type what we want to require we want laravel installer so just type it laravel and installer installer when you hit enter it will download your installer laravel installer and it will take little bit time to download all the uh, repositories all the files so as you can see 10 packages you are using looking for funding and something like i don't know what is this but just our installer has been installed successfully then we will check our laravel installer our install or not so for that we need a command laravel and it enter so you can see i have a laravel installer 4.1.1 so this is my laravel installer version now we will create project or block or any application of laravel so for that we need a command laravel laravel and new and you can give your application name like application or a blog blog or anything you can type your project project name so just i'm typing uh, test application test block like this and hit enter so it will download let me uh, okay we have to wait because it will take uh, less than five to i think it will take 10 to 20 seconds maybe it's depend on our internet speed okay so for that we need to wait okay it's updating dependencies so guys uh, i'm teaching you uh, step by steps right i'm not escaping any steps so please subscribe my channel and uh, give a thumbs up and whatever you want let me know what you think okay or uh, installing or our blog are creating automatically our application are generating y composer commands so we need to wait after this command i think it will take a long time it's not 10 to 15 seconds but it's depend on your internet speed okay so we need to wait wait guys wait oh my god it's taking too much time tokenizer i don't know lots of libraries and uh, files and folders and it's creating for us okay i don't know what it's thinking now generating optimize auto load files illuminate application ready guys as you can see application ready build something amazing so now we have a 
install uh, install and uh, create a blog and any application and now we need to check dir inside dir so as you can see we have a directory which is test blog so we need to go in this directory this is okay so cd test underscore blog and hit enter if you don't know what is cd chain directory you can simply go to your project test block and you also you can type it cmd and you can come here then now the time is to run our application so lar will provide a very nice and simple command to run our application which is php rt sun artisan serve which is this one and hit enter oh my god what's the problem mm, oh i got a mistake because spelling mistake artisan right let me n and hit enter okay so our server has been started and now we need to copy this url let's copy and uh, open a browser like this it's so uh, simple and paste that url and hit enter so guys oh, here is a magic to install laravel add and simply we have successfully installed laravel add okay so if you have any questions and any doubts and uh, I don't know what you think about this but you can ask a questions if you have any question in your mind so thanks for watching